in this video, we're going to focus on the scatter chart for streaming in Chart.js. And this is another video of the Chart.js plugin streaming series. So in here now, you already figured out how to create a combo chart here with the line and bar chart combined. However, let's start to create a scatter chart. And a scatter chart is quite straightforward. I'm going to remove the type here because we don't want to have a combo related to scatter and a bar chart or a line chart. All we want to do here is to make a scatter chart. If we save this, and this is the nice thing of a scatter chart, the scatter chart uses the two data points here as well, the x and y, or y and x, so let's let's convert them, just putting them in the right order. Let's save this, and here, and now you can see here, we get now a scatter chart. The real difference between a scatter chart and a line chart is basically the line chart has a line, while the scatter chart only grabs the point radius. As you can see here, and now we have this, and this looks beautiful, except for that we should have an intersect, but the intersect doesn't respond here accordingly. However, this is the way how you can do it. Thank you for watching this video, and I hope you enjoy it. And if you enjoy this video, you probably will enjoy this one as well. And if you're interested in Chart.js, check out in the description box the link directing to my Chart.js course, where you can learn everything about Chart.js. And finally, of course, Make sure you subscribe to my channel.